אני אלה שואתי, אבטח ולא אבחד, כי אזי בשמרת אדוני הייתה לי והיא לי לשואה. ושבת מים בששון ממעייני הישוע, לאדוני הישוע, על עמך ברכתך סלע, אדוני צבאות עמנו, נשגב לנו, אדוני יעקב סלע, אדוני צבאות. אשרי אדם בוטח בך, אדוני הושיעה, המלך יעננו ביום קוראנו, ליהודים הייתה אורה ושמחה, בששון בעיקר. כן תהי לנו, כוס ישוע תשא, ובשם אדוני אקרא. ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם, בורא פרי הגפן. ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם, בורא מיני בשמים. ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם, בורא מאורי האש. ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם, המבדיל בין קודש לחול, בין אור וחושך, בין ישראל לעמים, בין יום השביעי לששת ימי הנעשה. ברוך אתה אדוני המבדיל בין קודש לחול. And any bullshit, my name is Angela, hey, hello I pushed the net out the door Her and her poodle can't hurt us no more No more I left all of the folks from school They didn't give me nothing cool But some hides and anxiety It took a person in animation So you were originally thinking of making Like the wax sculpture from rope Based on mm-hmm. a Jewish candle? Yes. Can you explain yes. that a bit, please? Um, so it's called a Havdalah candle. Um, it's a braided candle and it's used um, on Saturday nights. It's kind of, you like burn the candle just for a short while as part of like a ritual which, which marks the end of Shabbat and like the mm-hmm. start of the new week. And like other parts of the ritual are like drinking wine and smelling um, sweet spices. Mm. And it's like meant to be like, you know, really grounding and... Um, like you do it at twilight outside. Ideally. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's, it's a really beautiful one that I always want to do more of. There's like some instructions online for braiding your own Havdalah candles, but usually with like, um, you get the uh, dipped wicks pre-sent to you and it's like a really soft wax that you then can braid however you like on your own. But I'm going to try to do this all by myself um, using my dad's beeswax he is a beekeeper so i have plenty on hand so this is my studio <laughs> hi is here this is my bedroom and working in my bedroom is hard because i also sleep here and it would be nice to have a proper studio one day but This is it for now. Yeah, and there's something really nice about the braiding. Yeah, it's like therapeutic or something, isn't it? Mm. And is a lot of your work influenced or like in response to Judaism? Yeah. Yeah? (laughs) Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) That's good. (laughs) Yeah. Yeah. Is it a way that you kind of like reflect or comment on, on it or just like a way of, mm. another way of expressing yourself as in like your culture and your, and your beliefs or. Yeah. I, I think a bit of both. Mm. I'm like, I've like in the past, I've been like particularly interested in like, um, like personal family history, but yeah. also like, um, like Judaism in like cultural contexts of like, trans experience yeah and um like like politics of like diaspora and place and yeah um things like that so yeah like in one way or another i think like judaism has been like a big part of the work i'm doing Mm. Uh, like my honors project is about like um making Jewish ritual objects that facilitate emerging and marginal ritual practices. Wow. Yeah, yeah, so like, it's, it's always around in one way or another. Yeah, that's great.
Pulling myself to my feet Pulling myself to my feet Pulling myself to my feet, feet. Little feet, they pitter patter over kitchen floors and Legos splattered. What I dream with you is shattered. Bitter batter cookie dough, we ain't planned it, we ain't satin, we need a ring. I've been attaching, I've seen some things. If we're separate together, we'll see what brings. I am a vine, but I cannot ignore my thorns. And I'm needing to put you aside so that I can have my thoughts. The time won't fly by, fine, but I need to.